Hello, my dear people. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. We are here again to tell you that the very big wind that blew in Biafra struggle has already done great work. All right? Screening. It has shifted the chaff. The chaff, they have all gone. Those that cannot sacrifice for Biafra. Those that are selfish, those that are wicked, those that are sellout, those that can collect money and those that can give money, those that can point hand and those that can leak secret, they are all out. Yes, that wind has done great job. Unfortunate thing in that wind is that Mazi Namdekano is not freed yet. But that has shown us that Actually, Mazin Namdekano is selfless, dying for Biafrans, when Biafrans cannot do much for him, cannot even try for him. Oh, what a pity. Now they are trying to make Mazin Namdekano to die in DSS custody by pushing him to say what he's not supposed to say. They say you must talk. If you are the one sending Simon Eba and the Biafra Liberation Army to kill Nigerian army, he said he must talk. He said that he, he, he must deny Simon Eba or he will accept killing Nigerian army. So these are two traps against Mazen Namdekano set by the inner carcass. Those you call um, freedom fighters, Ikenga Urago is the one that the wind of the time has blown off. And there are many. Many are still up, up, unfolding. As you follow this video, our brother Emmanuel Oremijus, oh my God, you just need to hear him. All right? Let's go and um, I'll be right back. <laughs> no, no, no. It is Mazen Namdekano's own turn. <laughs> They are pushing you. Where are you? Need the OS are wise. They don't they push you now. They said, oh, you cannot. Okay, Chuku said, Mazen Nam Dekano, you cannot turn IPOB into family business. Why must you negotiate without the consent of DOS? You must tell us what that negotiation is all about. We are the DOS. We're supposed to know things about you. Asusun Din teacher. We are these people, not the same people who told you that they are working for Mazen Nam Dekano. They played all sorts of records for you to follow them. Now, it is the same person that they played his record and said, anytime that I'm not around, DOS, anything DOS says goes. On the same person that they lied to you is the same person that they are insulting in broad daylight. In broad daylight. After insulting Simon Eba, now it is the turn of Mazen Namdekano. They are Nereshio. Without fear, let me go direct and play it, please. Because there will be no time onto this very program. We must move. Right. We must move. Right. For those of you who do not know, this very program was done by Okechuku. This one, this particular one here, this one here. Ofekebori is here. He is the person that did this very program. He, in this program, he insults and bash on Mazen Namdekano. And he told him, Do you think that we are fools? You call us. You want to use us and dump us. You cannot use us. You cannot dump us. When the barista, what are they calling him? Barista Tony, Tony Mantena. Barista Tony White. When he was everywhere lying to you people. And Mazen Nam the Kanos was trusted. Mazen Nam the Kanos said this. The Simon. Mazen Nam the Kanos said Simon is a criminal. Benjamin came and said, Mazen Nam the Kanos stood up and said, 
Man said, Simon is a criminal. Why am I? These are the lies, remember? They lie these lies without fear. In broad daylight, they told you these lies. But whereas every other person that goes to visit Mazen Namdekano gets a different message. FC with China Samuel and the Jo4 came out and told you people. I visited when I visited my my, my Nigerian husband or my British husband. He told me, he asked of Agone Chamber, and in this one, Agone Chamber turns out to be Tina Samoru. The same Tina Samoru now is crying that they don't know. Mazen Namdekano have blacklisted them. But I told you then that she he was lying to all of you. Now come and listen to the mother of all exposition. He said he doesn't go to Master Simon Eba. He doesn't listen to him. Ask this Okoko, where is he getting? Simon will do one program. Immediately, this Okoko will come on his program to use it. And say, Simon is a liar. He's a criminal. This is how they tell you lies. I don't go to your prime minister and I don't listen to him. Where are you getting? Even here now, somebody that have told you that he doesn't listen to PMO. Here now he will still tell you about PM that he doesn't listen to. Hello, you are welcome. I want to ask this question because I will start this continuation also on our lawyer to back home. My question to them is this, because I will keep on lamenting. Why I'm saying this is because some of you or the way this struggle was before. Like I've been saying this that this struggle before was a family business. Oh, no, and it will never be like that again. Oh, no, that is the reason why. Do you hear it? This family struggle before was a family business. And it is him that is saying it. Which means, Onyendu Nerihamugu. According to them, it was a family business. Now go and ask this Obonu. Your China Samoru, his mother is a treasurer in Italy. The sister is a coordinator in Italy. The brother is a what? All his families, even in Dogo, are employed in IPOB. Mew came from, oh, so as uh, donate for Eastern Security Network, Ashiata. When you donate, it goes down to their pockets. The Eastern Security Network, the Mughals that they are telling you, is it not those ones that appear in Abba? That look very hungry. Is it not that one, those ones? Let the Bayejima. Is it not those ones? Let us go, please. Listen, you know, he is going to come out. This one now is Mazen Namdekano's own turn. They are now carrying the same propaganda they carried against Simon. I told you the end target is Mazen Namdekano. They we are not targeting Simon. The end target is Mazen Namdekano. Because had it been they got Simon to shut up, had it been they blackmail Simon to shut up, they will equally blackmail Mazen Namdekano. Have it happened? On a making another van. As I tell you, so it shall be. Why? So many of the siblings will come out and begin to say things they don't know. They begin to see this our struggle. They begin to see this our struggle like eh, eh, only do you know sometimes I believe why even though can have a canon can make call that send me to criminal police. I believe why I know the reason why he was doing this, because there's a lot of things going on before. Because of the good heart of these people, because they want to 
want everything to be going forward because they want things to be moving. When he tell you that Kananta, there are a lot of things going on before. Kananta, when he comes out, he will see the leadership of Wanda Ayama. Because Kananta no, actually know most of them begging money on the streets. That's the truth. That is what he's saying. Kananta actually know most of them begging money on the streets. Some of them in India, we are brought from the streets. Ndineme Yahoo, fell the Yahoo. Some of them no more than 10 in one room. Eight in one room. Go and ask them. Say that I, 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 I am the one saying it before they join this IPOB. Like this Okechukuna. He wasn't squatting before. I think with, uh, with uh, one failed uh, fake white woman. He was squatting before. Doing fake DJ. M.A. DJ. Reibo. Anunike. But when Biafra came, all of them would you. And now they are not going Let me go forward. We cannot take rubbish from you. Because you want peace to, to win. I have to say, uh, I want all things not damage. And we have come. I have come. I want to And we will see. We don't come. We don't come. Also, you can also keep your work on. You are claiming to be what you are not. You go on the work. Now you are gone. Now they are now recognizing people just as I'm recognizing. They have a big platform. Go and check since he did this very program. Only 2,000. 2,000 something have watched it. No longer before 20,000, 30, 50. Let them come and watch you. Can. I will be now the 30 pig. Let them come and watch. My viewers are here are even more than your big platform viewers. Okay, you can hardly hear him. Let me let me elaborate it, please. Okay. My viewers here are more than your your Abakaratin Gum platforms. Osuike, you are welcome. That one uh, insult him. Also chukuk bonnengoko. Me here like come and carry your child. Let us go, please. <laughs> Am I claiming what I'm not? Am I coming here to listen to your idiot? I am what I am. I am Mazo Kinoki. I don't claim to be anybody. I don't claim to be anybody. Are you hearing it loud and clear now? All of them. Do you hear the goof that he is goofing? That Onyendu is pleading to Nigeria. These are the so-called media warriors. I haven't died POB. Onyendu never pleaded to any Nigeria. What Onyendu added and what is in the suit of Onyendu, if you don't want to release me, you must, even if there is anything, we must sit on round table to discuss. 
That round table discussion is to usher Biafra. That round table discussion, there is no decent that you cannot sit on round table. Okay, if you we divide now, what are the benefits that we can benefit from all of us? Okay, as Onion do rightfully said, let our people go, then we pipe oil into every country in Africa. We don't need oil. Igbo man don't, doesn't need oil. What Igbo man needed is freedom to excel. Innocent them, he pay to them. And every brainy Biafran is not oil, oil. Our mentality is not fixed on this. Our mentality is on creativity. Give us a platform to excel. They are now saying, according to him, Onyendu is pleading to Nigeria to forgive him. On what? Like when the media warrior, this is the awesome mirror, this will fake Yana and go worry. And Onyendu will tell him, and Onyendu will tell him, okay, let me, let me pardon your people. This is the awesome mirror, the ofeke. Yanago, and onion do you say, okay, let me let me just pardon the the old sheet and bring them in. Obroge. Akone be the way. About this, how it's going to fit. My question now is he talking about the list of holding to or are they going to negotiate of Biafra restoration? That is the question. Are you people paying attention to this question? The political solution Aloy Ejimako is proposing, is it for him to release Olendo to just come out or for them to go for the round table seat and talk about what it takes for you people to be free? How are we going to free you people? Okay. Do you hear the goof? After day, this one is Olendo's attack direct. Remember, Few days or a week ago, they gathered in Fulani Radio, the former Radio Biafra, and they voted for One Nigeria, restructured the Nigeria. They voted for One Nigeria. Look at the people that voted for One Nigeria. It's now against what is Onyendu discussing. Why is Onyendu not involving us? Remember, they have voted for One Nigeria. They have voted for one Nigeria. When I told you that DOS never represented Onyendu, you thought that it is a lie. You will still hear it that Onyendu have sacked them. But Benjamin Mumadu Benzi, that the people of Biafra, by the way, defending his house, very dirty thing. Very, very dirty thing. Um, putana, that, that is the puta. Very dirty thing. I wonder that smells. He smells every time on perfume. A man who may should go and then I want to the capital sign up on to only or change the channel to somewhere. In the name of our dada, if you know, you know. Because of social media, please. In the name of our Who said uh, he visited Onyendu? He confronted Onyendu. That was the word that he used. And I told you people, these people are lying. For using that word, confrontation, he lied. He never visited Onyendu. And I made my own visitation. The visitation stopped. They could have started a uh, continue now. Can I visit Onyendu? Do you hear him? Let us go, please. Because that is what I don't even understand. What these people are going for. See, like I said, they have succeeded by pushing everybody away. Simon, I go what a quick one. Simon, but I go what a quick one. 
Simon, by argument, I quay, wom, wom, wom. They said you have succeeded in pushing them away. You told them, by the time I finish dealing with all of you, <laughs> there is something that I love. You see, if you are a said spiritualist, once you see something, stand on it. No matter what. In case you ever model, sometimes you say, ah, these people might push this person down. Not that the person is not on the right track, because a lot of them that they come to follow this Umokoko knew that DOS are not in the right track, but they want to join majority. Now the DOS have said their Nam the Kano have pushed them away. Simon Eta have pushed them away. They don't know what they are doing. They are in disarray. They are in disarray. They said that you have succeeded. We have succeeded. Everyone have succeeded in pushing them away. Right now they are at the back of the fence. That defines the uh, dream of Uchechi Okukano. Do you now get it? Who is Uchechi standing with the uh, criminals? That defines her, uh, her dream. Her, I mean, her nightmare, not dream. She said that she saw that she went to house knocking. Nobody wants to open. They lock her outside. They push her out and lock her outside. And she said, that the consequences. She jumped fence. D.O.S., please, did you who church? She's going to jump fence and leave all of you. <laughs> she will jump fence and leave all of you. Damn the consequences. She jumped fence, going to work. Did you who church? Because I had you people calling her to intervene and help you people. Did you know church? She will jump fence and leave all of you. But when she jumped the fence and Eze and Lola then told her, oh, wait outside, don't worry, everything is going to be all right. They now push her outside. Which means we, the representatives of Eze and Lola, is going to be looking for two by two in order to use to escort her outside. Is God not wonderful? Is God not wonderful? Let us go, please. I pray the undiluted truth here and the heavens may are listening. Personal business, like I always tell my people. Just imagine that the leadership don't know about what is going on. This negotiation they are going now. They call they, they, when they kidnap your mass in the current Kenya. They kidnap him because of IPOP. Okay? They redition him because of IPOP and our activities, things that we have done by saying the truth, by preaching the gospel to the world for them to know the reason why we want to be free from that contraption. That is the reason why they are holding him, nothing else. Okay. He is now complaining. Just imagine. Mazen Namdekan is going for negotiation and DOS doesn't know about it. Why must it be so? That uh, Mazen Namdekan should remember that when they kidnapped him in Kenya, they kidnapped him because of IPOB. That is when they sold him in Kenya and then started fighting Simon Eba. They sold him because of IPOB. Now let me clear you, Ofeke. Ofeke Bori. Oeku Yerinte. Inaga Abontunike. Abonyen tu na wolo ni ile wolo ni ile butan tuntu and wolo ni ile na ishizi mmiri maka ntu akpora na wolo I want to let you know Mazen Namdekano is the pillar of IPOB is the one that brought everyone close with truths Na ngi wana agwa sumini ever since you people so do nyendo have anyone taken your people serious you have been buying people to obey you you have been buying and busting to buy people and you thought that you think in your widest dream that Mazen Namdekan is going to hear it and clap for your people 
Where are you not the person lying to Biafra people that you do it on the order of Mazen Namdekano? That it is Mazen Namdekano who ordered your people. Have you forgotten? When you were buying Biafra people and you said it was Mazen Namdekano who ordered your people, that uh, you people hears and gets message from Mars. Eh? Have you forgotten the lies that uh, the barrister, Tony Mantena, the one in this array, the one that the Biafra people will protest very soon, will protest against? Have you forgotten how he has been going from one pillar to post Telling your people that uh, Mazen Namdekano said this to him. Mazen Namdekano said that Simon Ebe is a criminal. Mazen Namdekano said by everybody. Mazen Namdekano said he will not. Have you forgotten? I am telling you, Ukoko. So when you do and commit all sorts, all manner of atrocities, and you believe in your widest dream that Mazen Namdekano is going to listen to that cock and bull story, that bullshit that you are talking about. Do you believe so? Uh, when they kidnap you in Kenya, they kidnap you because of Mazen uh, IPOB. Who is the pillar of IPOB? Did we see Ofeke Child and join? No Biafra see Ofeke Child and join. No Biafra see uh, Mohamed Abbas and join. No Biafra see uh, HIV Edozi and join. No Biafra see Yahu Boy uh, Emeka Gift and join. No Biafra see Washioko uh, uh, Philosopher and join. No Biafra see, no Biafra see uh, the one hiding in Pigeon Hole, hiding in every hole. His son is not a king, his mother is not a queen. But he's answering Prince Dalentin. No Biafra see them. No Biafra see Nkana or Paul Achebe and join. The one that said uh, that Onyendu should be tied. No Biafra see them and join. So what are you talking about? Oh, um, Mazen Namdekano should remember that it was on platform of IPOB. People follow Mazen Namdekano because of the good message he preached. Criminally, you remove Mazen Namdekano. Why are you say, saying Mazen Namdekano? Mazen Namdekano is the supreme leader of IPOB. Why did you remove him from IPOB? You criminally remove his name from being leader of IPOB. How, how shameful have you become? I did a program asking you people, what are your motives of removing Mazen Namdekano as the supreme leader of indigenous people of Biafra? What are your motives? What did you do? But your people keep on lying to people. The same people who told you that they went underground and who came to lie to you people that uh, what these people are doing, they are doing a, a very marvelous job on the ground are now coming out to say that uh, Mazen Namdekano have rejected them and underground. So the question should be now, who are they undergrounding with? Who are they undergrounding with? What have they been doing since Mazen Namdekano rejected them in totality? That person that they called criminal is the one that Mazen Namdekano have taken. And because of it, have resigned. I don't know, Ijiji. Ijiji agree. That is not me. It's what I had, the place. It's what I had. I am saying according to what I had. And he did agree. See, some we are faithful many in me. That is what I had. Am I communicating, please? You know, let us go and listen to the Arabic, please. Chineke, Chineke, Bounume. Let us go and listen to the Arabic, crying. And now, as time goes on, now it begin now they are now bringing us a personal lawyer not from IPOB because what our lawyer Jamako was is a personal lawyer to Mazen Nandekano now doubling into organization that he knows nothing about when we told you that these people doubt with Onyendu these people did doubt with Onyendu PM said it on his very platform that these people dealt with Onyendu big time and you did not believe. 
When we tell you that these people dealt with Onion do big time, did you believe? You did not believe. You did not believe. Now, do you hear what they are saying? That uh, so far, as long as Allah Yejimako, Onion do choose Allah Yejimako, they rejected Allah Yejimako. It becomes a personal lawyer to Onion do. Now, go and ask him. A GFO that they are running to, the stockbroker going to governors and this, and do to what they have sidelined them. No governor will come and take them serious anymore. The people that they know everywhere is the Afrika Republic government in exile. Everywhere. Everywhere. The Afrika Republic government in exile. Everywhere. And if they speak, the land will be shaking. Stand, the most of you have a job more in you. You cannot stand for the truth. And today that truth has prevailed. I told most of the people insulting me, telling me, hey, Benima, this and that, that this man called Simon is spiritually endowed. I told them, did I tell you? But they want me to join the heat of the moment. Oh, DOS, even though I told them. These criminals pleaded with me with money. They called me. Not them direct. Some, they used some criminals to call me, asking me how much can I take. That they know that what they paid me is money. But how much they are willing to pay me for me to be on the side of the OS. These criminals. So if you are saying the truth... Why would anyone pay, if you are on the right track, why would you pay people to support you? Where, did you, where would you get that money from that you will pay people? If you can pay me money, do you know how many people that they will pay to support them? So when they were going mad on social media, I knew that it is all about money. One day it will dry up. They told me, they used some criminals. There is one that called me. We spent hours. He said, I do not, it's not that the OS sent me, but later I will call Chike, I will call this person to relate with him. And they claim that they doesn't know whom Imane Oremi Juice is. But it time, they, they, they send people. If they are not the one that send you, why are you reporting back to them? You assured me you will report that back to them. But please, brother, don't go against, uh, against uh, DOS. Uh, that guy called Simon, he said, Belima, I asked them, today you have seen it. They are now fighting Mazen Namdekano, after which they failed. Your own fighting against Mazen Namdekano, you have failed. What makes you think that it is Mazen, uh, I mean, your own fight against Simon, you have failed. What makes you think that it is Mazen Namdekano that you can fight and succeed? What makes you think? Huh? I want to mention stand on the truth and we know that we stand on the truth so he is the he is the epitome of the truth how do they go out to represent the truth from right from time that is the reason why all these women pia pia demons saying oh why must onion do say this why must onion do if you uh, if you are in the show of onion do self, you would give up. Sometimes I wonder the mentor, the, the kind of brain that God gave you, gave you this Mazen Namdekano. At a time, they hide the Mazen Namdekano and they were telling you that he was having mental illness. Or have you forgotten what, what uh, a, a, a Jehovah said? Have you people forgotten what a Jehovah said? 
that Mazen Namdekani is having score score. That uh, the things that they did him in Kenya have affected his brain and he's not uh, in good term. Me meaning Skoska, all manner of propaganda as they channel it against Simon. They equally channel it against Mazen Namdekan systematically then. But now, before you, they have come out to insult Mazen Namdekan. Listen and open your ear. You will hear insult and you will shock. He have told Mazen Namdekan, we cannot take that rubbish from you. Not from you. We can't take it. That is what Okechuku hiding in Germany. Okechuku come back here and fight, eh? Nah? You people who are the cap of Eastern Security Network of them and lie that you are representatives of Eastern Security Net Network. That you enter the Eastern Security Network over there. Why you never attend any lecture? Because if you attended even single lecture, even a day, you will understand the reason for the Eastern Security Network. You are not a volunteer. I pass all of you, even all of you over there. I serve as a state secretary of volunteer. So my record surpasses that. Your people have not done anything. Have you faced torture in Nigeria? I join, I am proudly saying, the Nakatami soldiers have carried me twice. One in Abuja and they released me immediately. One in 2006. Many of you don't know that Nigerian soldier carried me in Abuja and they released me immediately. Mark as spiritual DSS. Spiritual DSS, power DSS. Most of them see me, they saw. They, they, we are saying, oh, Remigius have gone. They were surprised as I came back. They were very, very surprised. Spiritual was a SS. Another group carried me. Another group was pursuing the group that carried me and told them that they, you must release me. You must release me. And I said, hey, is this how power works? Power the SS. In my mind, I was like looking at them. These people said, but let us go and listen to Ofeke, Ofeke Chuku. Okay, I'm back. I'm back. Network. Network was networking me. And me, I was networking the network. Let us go and listen to Ofeke Chuku. You go, don't go in outside the organization. Who is the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra? Now, do you know what they are saying? They are now saying that DOS rank is more than Mazen Namdekan, the supreme leader. Supreme leader. No, the uh, DOS have been, been disbanded by Onyendu and they are going mad. They are saying his, their rank is more than Onyendu. And they are saying, you don't go outside the organization. They want us to be doing tout, tout thing. Simon Epa came and said, under five years, I will restore Biafra. Five years agenda. That is how you know somebody that knows the road. And under one and a half years, he have restored a good, from last two years to now, because he started moving from 2022 to now. 2021 was just a fighting against uh, uh, this DOS. I say, DOS, I say, this and that. DOS is, uh, did all manner of propaganda against him and he started exposing them. 2021. 2022, he embarked back on the journey. And it was set back. 2023, he was fruitlessly uh, embarked on the journey. And look at where he is today. A matter of two years. There is a lobbying firm, there is this, there is a, a Gemma, there is a Biafra liaison offices everywhere, scattered everywhere in the world. There are 
the, he have achieved tremendously. What about the Biafra Liberation Army? Well, kids, when you see what these people carry, in the whole years of this criminal DOS that sent our people to die in the police station, where they are snatching AK-47. These DOS criminals sent people's children to die, not Mazen Namdekano. This is the lie that they keep on lying to Mazi because Mazen Namdekano relied on them to get information. What is happening? They keep on lying to him. Did you go to a police station to snatch a gun? Onion, uh, uh, they will say, Onion, do no, we did not go. But I heard it from Nigerian news. They will say, Onion, do we did not go. As your child, did you even tell us, us, that uh, we don't go out to call Mazen Namdekano direct to tell him what is happening? That anybody caught will be treated as an enemy. Why did you put that law? That we do not call Mazen Namdekano direct to tell him what is happening. What we are you hiding? What we are you hiding? Did you put the law that nobody should call Mazen Namdekano to relate to him what was happening? That anybody caught will be treated like an outlaw. Now, the reason why you put that law, the reason why you started threatening people, we now know it. We have your record, Oga. That's who you can. before you do you hear them these are your ndos are wiser they are now telling nigerian government look at the video there is one thing that a lawyer in Marco said even though they do not understand law they will interpret rubbish oh mazen namdekana mazen simon is the same how are you still looking for those that kidnap onyendu do you hear it from them now not that these people, most of the times people will say these people are ignorant of the kidnapping of Onyendu. They participated in the kidnap because of monetary gain. Okay? Most of them were afterthought betrayer, like PM said. Do you now hear it? But most of you, the DOS are wise to Iraq, that we are everywhere advertising your rubbish and your uselessness they told you before that simon was working for nigerian government and i told you in my exposition these people are using this term because it is an intelligent issue they are using it to deviate and deflect your attention so that you heard simon that he is working for nigerian government but in the other way around you have vetted mazen namdekano have you bothered to ask the personalities of those whom you are supporting against Mazen Namdekano that uh, you do not sleep, you run to Radio Biafra to listen. They pay the, all this small, small devil to blackmail his holy name. Have you asked yourself? Oh, Mazen, Simon Emma was working for Nigerian government. Today, it is said by Okechuku that Mazen, Simon Emma is working for Mazen Namdekano. And according to Okechuku, uh, buying of soldiers, buying of soldiers that Simon is doing is for Mazen Namdekan. According to Okechuku, according to Okechuku, I do not support, listen please, on this very platform, I do not support violence. Of any violence of any shape, form, or anything, I do not support violence, please. What I do here is analyzing things that come out from people's mouths. I do not support violence. I am a pro-human. I support United Nations Charter for Self-Defense and People's Rights. I support people 
who are feared to be bide to defend themselves. I support that, but do not support violence. Please use your brain. Let us go, please. That is exactly what our Lord Michael told them. And you people think that we, we are coming here to joke. I will also bring a video of Maxwell, one of the lawyers, when he was saying that uh, Simon ever don't listen to anybody. talking about Mazen Namdekano coming out. When we ask you people, the criminals in DOS, when a GFO was around, you told us that you pay lawyer. What are you doing? You pay lawyer. You are agitating for Onyendu to come out. Nah! Have you seen that they did you people? Plenty of you, they did you people 419. Do you hear it from him? We are not talking about Onyendu coming out because he told us a lot of things. We are freedom fighters are supposed to be. We want you to go and negotiate Biafra. You want him to go and negotiate Biafra, but you on uh, Fulani Radio, you have a negotiated one Nigeria. Why did you negotiate one Nigeria using Radio Biafra to negotiate one Nigeria? Many of you people following me here don't know that these people gathered themselves on Radio Biafra, the former Radio Biafra, now Fulani Radio. They said, and I quote, that they are now supporting regional government in Nigeria, which means one Nigeria, but regional government. So if you have uh, voted for it, Without the consent of Onyendu, who is the supreme leader. Because when all of these things started, you people said, every order will come from Onyendu. Now you have go and vote for one Nigeria. And Onyendu is not agreeing in the one Nigeria. Why they gathered is for them to record it and take it to Onyendu and say, look at your boys, so they have voted for him to agree. Onyendu look at them and wave. So they have come back to fight him. Onyendu is going for Biafra. We are not talking about Onyendu coming out. They are telling you now. So, if you are not talking about Onyendu coming out, what was the criminal age of wasting all his time doing? He won no court case. The appeal court, or the every other court that they are saying, what they did, the Jofo did, was that uh, Aloy Ejimako won case in Abia State. Ejofo took it to a court in Abuja to tell them, look at the what court have declared in Abia State. And the court in Abuja said that the, what, he, what the court in Abia State declared is what they will stand on. That is the only thing. Ejofo never won any case for IPOB. So what we are here doing? What we are here doing? Do you now hear them? We are not talking about Onyendu coming out. Now, open your ear. The main insult is now coming. Please. They will go harder on Onyendu. Open your ear, please. Agwara mohona agwa. Ngo no ya shi nan tenka po. O shi nan tenka po. Ya shi nan tenka. I told you people earlier. Abinishu that these criminals never meant well for all of you but uh, due to the hatred of simon Eba, simon due to your hatred all this party anti that you people are playing today the so-called nigeria are those people that were supposed to be you know telling mazen namdekano giving him uh, how can we going to do this mazen namdekano will now be telling them okay now if you people say you don't want to give these people freedom for them, to implement to everything that I have told you people to do. Because
because how has it not I've been telling you people to do? As it stands today, we don't have international airport. As it stands today, the, the, the second Niger Bridge they are building, they go and build it low so that they won't be large ship that enter, go to enter them. Not nothing. Restructuring the promise all of you, nothing comes. Not all of us. It is you people. It is you criminals in the US that they promised restructuring. Okay, you know all of these things that the government is doing and you are fighting Simon Eba, fighting against the government. You went and supported the governor of Anambra State. Have you forgotten your advert? And after advertising the governor of Anambra State, you people started advertising his son. Oh, his son is a very good musician. This and that because he will receive Rego. Have you? Have you? You advertised the governor of uh, Enugu State. Have you not? You went at the back to support us, hope us or them, to conquer the man. Did you? Chineka, but I know no, Kribe Simon, no, no. Oh, yeah, be listening, please. Okay, you people are going there for mass and now they cannot just to come out. I will go by a person. But I'm already on money. Mazen Namdekano said, I am coming and I will bring hell. And Mazen Namdekano said, anytime Nigeria government lay hand on me, turn the zoo down. Did you? We are you waiting for Onyendu to come? You said that you, you want to hold the struggle for Onyendu to come out. Did you do anything to pressurize Nigerian government? The answer is no. Instead, you went and be doing hallelujah to Ohaneze and Daran and Doshi. Today, you are against Ohaneze. We are you not the same person singing praises, advertising Obi of Furniture, saying, Oh, he is the, oh, your father. You declared on Radio Biafra that, Oh, nobody, that they have used, the, they have insulted your kings, the, our fathers, there's an ending here that you people cannot support it. Did you not? Did you not? Did you not, Ndara, fail the career agitators? Did you not? Today, you are going, you are talking down on them. Okay, did they buy you? You, we are the same person. You people could have been the person in the shoe of Master Simon Eber, pushing and pushing. You don't need to wait for Master. Master Namdekano told you people that Nelson Mandela was inside and his people were pushing. Pushing and pushing, they never stopped. And he asked you people, how many of you know that uh, uh, South Africa went into armed struggle? How many of you know? They keep on pushing and pushing. They did not say, oh, why yeah, we have not gotten our freedom. Oh, let us be slave. Onyendu taught all of you. Onyendu even taught all of you, the present Ambazonian, that their leader is inside. But another person, a Zoom leader, in order to continue to fight, to make a way for the release of their leader. Onion do teach all of you these things. And you are now, oh, Onion do will come out. Kaidi de bayo kosere. Fell the career agitators. Lego do kahashi yoku. Kan dina machashi yoku. Onamari phone on email. You are welcome. You are welcome. Now I want you people to understand. So we gonna go tell a lawyer, Jima Kosia. Nea Hanako and I have a five by POB. And I want to say this here. I want to send a message to Lord Lucia Shitia, the wife of our leader. That anytime I'll grab back again, Peter, you are welcome. Anytime I'll grab back again to visit Oyendo, that go in do not media. I'm very, very angry. You should go and tell Onyendu that you see all this thing that is playing, we are not going to take it. Yaga, because behind the open eye, we say, after that, we are going to be saying the same thing. Do you now hear it? That Uchechi, look at the worst insult. Uchechi, you brought this insult upon yourself. No longer, man, Oromi Juice insulting you. This one, Nana, no more Coco insulting you. Uchechi Munyan did the OSC. Oh, he kept 
Bembe, bembe, bembe. Have you seen how you have disgraced yourself? Have you seen? They are now sending you to your husband. Uh, the person that you call your husband. We now know it's your fault that, uh, according to impregnated you, according to all of you know how it came on this social media. That, uh, and I said it, we need DNA for move to Also, you have to and say, oh, I don't know what happened. We need DNA for those, those children. We need DNA. We need DNA. DNA, we need it for those children. We need it. They are not sending her. Go and tell your husband that that nonsense that he is doing, we can't take it. Because he is in a fubu, or Potagonu, we will tell him to his face, we can't take it. But these people, we are the people telling you, oh, the reason why that they, uh, they are fighting against Simon is because they have known that when Onyendu come out, Simon is going to fight Onyendu. They are the people fighting Onyendu. Are you still looking for those who kidnap Onyendu? Is your the qua most of you? Ma. Are you are you still telling me that you don't know that these criminals kidnap Onyendu? Is that what you are telling me? Okay, Uche, Uche Atono. You have heard the message, you know. Go and tell uh, this thing. But surprise, surprise. Uche Echi never visited Onyendu. Uche Echi knew it. That is the reason why she declined to appear in court. Any day that she appears in court, just as I'm telling you now, write it down. Any day Uchechi goes to court, she will be disgraced. I put it as a challenge. One, one million. One, one million. I have people, I have men who can support this one, one million challenge. Even if I put it 10, 10 million. Let Uchechi go to court. Oburuna, Oburuna, Onahu, Bobo. Let her go to court. I put it as a challenge. Since the even the first time that Uchechi said that she visited Onyendu, she never visited Onyendu till today, three years plus. She never visited Onyendu. That was the reason why to make you believe that she visited Onyendu, she said that Onyendu asked her. Have you come to kiss me the last kiss? That is the kiss of death. According to her, she said it with her mouth, not me. She said it on her platform that that was what Onyendu asked her. That was what Onyendu asked her. Have you come to kiss me the last kiss? Yeah, I'm kissing Judas is carrot. Kissing Judas. Uchechi said, Onyendu asked me, have you come to kiss me the last kiss? That is the kissing of Judas Iscariot. Judas of Onye Cariot. Or Judas on Atakarot. to go and tell Onyendu but that without you, without him letting us know what is happening we can't take it, even from him we cannot take it go and tell Onyendu Akwela, go and tell Onyendu go and tell Onyendu go and tell Onyendu go and tell Onyendu Aquila, go and tell Onyendu. Kwe, kwe, go and tell Onyendu. That we cannot take that rubbish from him. Even though from him, we can't take it. We, Imane Oremiju, part of DOS now, can never take that rubbish from Onyendu. We in the DOS are boiling now. How can Onyendu sideline us? How can Onyendu sideline us? How can Onyendu not let us know? What is happening? How, how, how can Onyendu 
then they then do like Adobe. How can Onion do? Sideline us and never let us know what is going on. Oko Oko, Asimo Kepota, look at him. He will come out. Asimo Kepota, can your family boast? You have all got Moke. He is from Ihiala and I married from Ihiala. I am very close Ogo to Be Benjamin Madabunketa. Very close Ogo to Benjamin Madabunketa. Madaba no here. Benjamin Madaba no here. I married from him. He is Nguru. Benjamin Madaba no here. Look at them. Disgracing themselves. But you lied and lied and lied in order to position yourself that the reason why you are fighting against Simon is because he is going to fight against Onyendu and you are fighting to protect Onyendu. You people lie to the people that they don't know what you are protecting. Today, it is Onyendu that you are fighting against. Have any one of them, have any one of them bothered to ask the identity of these criminals? These 21st century arm robbers, have anyone bothered to ask? Have anyone? They told them, oh, just support in blindness, or support DOS, or blind. Don't ask questions. Because they know that if you ask questions, you will reason fine. They told you, don't ask questions at all. Just as you are mumu, continue mumu, narizing yourself. Chineke, oh dear me, God have mercy. Okay, let us go. Kaibapo, you also because there is no time. That we are Have you had it? The one, uh, the notorious liar called Uchechi came and told you people, oh, it's not sack against the Jofa, it is re strategizing. Oh, yeah, DOS still in charge. It is this. Do you now hear it? In the struggle. Cheke, does you know that? Uh, I told you people long ago, long ago, that onion do that I know in my Oremi Jews know that have had his voice that have spoken to us on WhatsApp can never support these criminals. And I don't mean personally, as in states when he calls states on WhatsApp and say, okay, put it in video call. Let me see my people cannot and will never support these criminals. We will never support these criminals. They will tell lying to you. Oh, Onyendu commanded us. Oh, Onyendu commanded us. Have you heard from them now? Now, Achoshisha, now all of them. So, how am I an offense? They are across the fence. That all of them have been choponalized. That all of them have been sacked. And they are not going to take it. They said they are not going to take it. Since you said that uh, you know the way forward. Continue your way now. Nah. After all, you told Simon eh, ah, that Simon should uh, do his own freedom. Today, Simon eh, ah, has built a brand. Biafra Republic Government in Exile is no longer group. It is the people. It is the citizens. And that is the reason why we have over 40 something million approaching. I don't know if it has gotten to 50 million that voted for Biafra referendum. Because now it's, it is no longer personal aggrandizement. It is no longer personal. It is the people. 
which Simon said, I am not the leader, but I'm the prime minister. They do not understand what that language means. They use it to cajole him. They said, oh, look at what he said. He's not the leader. He's uh, the prime minister. They put questions in order to nail that young man. And every time he outsmart them. But due to the illiteracy, imagine the barrister that cannot defend himself in court leading them. What do you think? The barrister that goes to court uh, uh, saying he has say, advising them, what do you think? They will all fall inside a pit with the nonsense advice that he is giving them. And that is the reason why today all of them are crying. We can't take it from Mazen Namdekano. Oh, we can't take it from Mazen Namdekano. No longer Simon. You can't take it from Simon. No longer Simon is a believer. Now it is Mazen Namdekan. We cannot take it. Why are you working with Simon? Why did you sack us? Why did you pursue all of us? Many people have died. Okay, Chuku, if you think that many people have died and you cannot take Mazen Namdekan, return all the money and the gain because in IPOB you have done nothing. This particular chair now, okay, Chuku, that you are sitting on, it was because of Simon Eba that you collected 4,000 euros to go and buy chair and this bead that you hang, 4,000 euros. Okay, to IPOB pay you every month just to talk rubbish on social media. You have not done any sacrifice to IPOB or whatsoever. Paul Achebe, IPOB, they pay them. Go and ask them, all of them, that sign oath of secrecy. With the said I IPOB. Chief Josiah said it now. That they pay them every month to be able to maintain the status quo. They paid all of you and only for you to collect the money of IPOB to fight the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. After his kidnap, Onaga Narego. After his kidnap, today, that money that you have been collecting, the money that you people are collecting, stealing from innocent people, contributing money, telling you people are telling them that freedom is coming. Okay, Chuku, you we are the same person who confessed that somebody is deceiving you, that Biafra is not is coming. We are asked, you know that Biafra is not coming. You, we are the same person that said it. So with Biafra, are you fighting? The Biafra that you have already said that you know that it is not coming. Okay, Chuku, full any child and way quensu. As some of you have started identifying with the devil, I mean, some of you have actually started identifying with the Kwensu. Let me go on and pray this undiluted message. As heavens may, I know that you are hearing my loud voice loud and clear, please. is after fighting Simon eh, but to say that we are fighting Simon in order to protect Onyendu. Now they have started fighting Onyendu. We don't care about us. What we want is what he is going to do. Onyendu, you see eh, what we in the OS want is what you are going to do. Because if you do not do it Milking IPOB. Milking IPOB. Ndame pere IPOB office in Ishi. Legono chow mari chono. Look at him here. Looking elegant. This whole attire was paid with IPOB money. They paid money to acquire it. Do you know why? They said that the reason why people listen to Simon Eber is because of the way and manner that he presents himself. He lives in a fine house, sits on a golden chair, that when he appeared on Facebook, even if you don't want to listen to him, you will be forced to listen to him. They gave him 4,000 euros. 4,000 euros. 
4,000 euros to acquire this. All of you know what that money is today. To acquire this. This nonsense. 4,000 euros. Now he sits on IPOB money. After fighting Simon Eber, he is now challenging the supreme leader. This is not a family something, but you are calling Uchechi to go and do the message, and it is not a family something. Call your DOS, the uh, Aquila, Aquila FC, that woman playing Aquila FC, that woman playing Akonandike FC, that football FC called Akonandike that uh, uh, allowed. Uh, um, Tony Mantena Barista, Tony Mantena FC to score some goals into a, another person's post. To score some goals. Na post in the model. A Jofonye goal. And that goal brought a fruit of a goalie. Brought a fruit of goalie. We will go to DNA test. After this, all of us will push Uchechi to DNA test. She can only hide in overseas. Anytime she steps her foot in Biafra land, she will undergo DNA test for us. We are the Biafra people. If she like, let her be hiding like a church rat or wherever that she chooses to. It's none of our business. But we, the Biafra people, we are determined to restore Biafra. We are going to protest against anybody. We are going to protest. It is our right to protest. It is enshrined, and we are going to do it, utilize our rights to protest against Uchechi and her football club called Akunike FC. Which brought the fruit of Goli. Mazi nye wangolu, barista nye wangolu. We can't take that rubbish. We are going to, we are going to descend. When I called you Chechi liars, you people told me, oh, stop with that thing. Are you now seeing it? All the lies that you Chechi told you. The DOS, only you said, DOS this, DOS that, DOS is the right channel. I, I went and told Onyendu, Onyendu said that I should greet Agune, Agune Chotele, Agune the other place. I was here telling you people that this woman is a conk liar. One of a verified liar. I told all of you. Is it not happening before all of you? Is it not happening before all of you? Unabia. Let us go, please. It's not a family song. All people may only do to ever escape ever. Okay, okay. But I don't bear that now. All people, people, people died that day. People. Twenty day over to the people died. We don't have to buy that now. We don't So you know that the people died. And you started supporting Nigerian government. You voted for one Nigeria. After knowing that people died, you voted for one Nigeria. Let me go to this hotel. After knowing that many people died for this freedom, this hotel is now voting for one Nigeria. All people, all people died. That 28 men, you know all of this. You went and supported the governors. The same governors that have buyed our people. You even supported them in Enugu State to buy our people. You supported them in Anambra State to buy our people. You know all of these things. I said one time, come confession go. Yeah, but this is confessional. All people, all people, you even know that all people, you are collecting salary from people. As it stands now, okay, Chuku is being paid monthly. Monthly, he is living in what is his work? I am a freedom fighter. Okay, Chuku is being paid monthly. From people who know, according to Okechukwu, 
Benjamin Madubugu is sleeping in Anambra State Government House. Can Onion do still do freedom with somebody who comfortably sleep in Anambra State Government House? I they are telling you, no people you know. So you people know, no people you know. You now see and sleep in the government house that ordered the killing of our people. From that Anambra State Government House, they ordered to kill our people and push them into a zoo river. It is there. Anybody who is in doubt should go and consult Amnesty International and Human Rights Watch. The atrocities of Nigerian government against the indigenous people of Biafra is there. They know all of these things and they keep quiet. They know all of these things and they keep quiet. So why are they telling you this happened and the other thing happened? Ask them, when did they start noticing all of this that they are telling you? Why that now? We don't, they don't know and we don't even know what is going on. They want to go and negotiate. Nego, nego, negotiate about it. I don't know what they are negotiating. We don't, we don't even know what they are going there to do. Hello, it's my corner. I've been proposing. According to Onyendo, Onyendo said that now I've been proposing. Hello, it's my corner. Hello, it's my corner. Hmm. Oh my goodness. A lot has been said here. A lot of secrets revealed. A lot, a lot, and a lot. Dear friends, this will teach you even how to live your own personal life. This, our freedom fighting, will teach you a lot. That the only person that can get you down very well is an in-house brother or sister. Be very careful. If you are not learning anything from this struggle, I myself am learning. I'm learning. All right? Emmanuel Oremidius, we must have to say a very big thank you for your talent that you are using to expose the enemies. You are truly a seer. You are understanding deeper things. You are not just understanding things at the peripheral level. You are understanding deeper things, and that is a, a virtue from God. We thank you. God bless you, listeners. God bless you. Please help us to share. Always come around for our own analysis. We'll give it to you raw. Thank you.